Now, my favourite thing of the show is the Young Gardeners of the Year, where six of the colleges create these spectacular show gardens. And they're only students, yet look at them. Well, I'm really looking forward to cooking with Chris. It'll be such an honour and a privilege and a joy. When you're in one of the show homes and you can see how it would actually work for you at home, it becomes very, very powerful. It becomes very easy to fall in love with. I've just seen giant deep fried mozzarella sticks oh. with truffle parmesan cheese on top. There's a whole day to be had here of food, drink and lots to see. Being able to come out, engage with people, see how they're reacting when you talk to them, it's a good buzz. What we want to do really is show and demonstrate that you can cook a beautiful meal in half an hour using beautiful ingredients and all you need is a board, a knife and a steamer. That's it. Oh, Sexy food here, I have so to say. Nice. And stuff that is unexpected as well. I've been pouring some Greek white wine. Oh, nice. Which has yeah, been amazing. It's really lovely to spring into summer with. People have been absolutely knocked out by it. Something off the beaten track that's, yeah, delicious. Ultimately delicious. Actually, it all boils down to this one thing, which is a celebration of what we British call home. We are such a connected society, but events like the Ideal Home give us a chance to genuinely connect with people in person, and I think that's really important that we never lose that connection. We love each other. Yeah. I start. have to say that Chris is an inspiration. So we'll see you later. We'll be eating we'll be and drinking, pretty much. <laughs> Come and join us. It's fun.